If you haven't guessed by now, the sport is called pickleball. That's right, pickleball, and it doesn't come in a jar. The guy that invented it had a dog with the name of Pickle. And as the ball would go off the court, the dog would go get the, there went Pickle's ball. So they decided, well, that's a good enough name for this. And now that has to make you think where we'd be today if the inventors of football or, let's say, baseball had a dog to retrieve the ball. Now getting back to Pickleball, you use an oversized ping pong paddle, a wiffle ball, add in the similarities of badminton and tennis, not to mention Pickleball strategy yourself in a position and so you're volleying and making quick hits and making them move the, and, and control the position of the ball. It's not in control where they go and so you can take the net away from somebody. At the ripe age of 10, pickleball is a novice on the sports scene. I read it in the uh, brochure and I had absolutely no idea what pickleball was. I thought it might have been a paddle with a pickle. I had one of them <laughs> correct. Once they get into it, they get the chance to play right away, pretty quick. And uh, they have to develop some skill, but th the game can start, and they're eager to play the game. Now, if you can look beyond the name, the sport of pickleball is very easy to learn and play. And the one nice thing about it, losing has a way out. You just simply say to your opponent, this is another nice pickle you've gotten me into. I'm Mitch Massey reporting.